What's up you guys, how's it going today? Hey, in this video I wanna talk about one of my favorite books ever of all time, and that is Top Knife. So it's called The Art and Craft of Trauma Surgery, and it is geared towards residents, surgery residents specifically, but I really think anybody can read this and, and understand it. It's really not very technical at all, but it gives you a great insight into how the trauma surgeon or emergency surgeon should think, and the things that need to happen uh, kind of in a graded order. It talks about bleeding, it talks about different organs and how to stop bleeding in different organs and what to do uh, when you get in trouble and stuff like that. And it's really very easy, easy read. And like I said, you don't need a lot of medical expertise to understand it. And um, if, you know, you might have to look up some words here and there, but it's really, for the most part, uh, this is Dr. Maddox who, uh, Ken Maddox, who is a, kind of a legend in trauma surgery, he wrote it, uh, heard him talk about this book, and the reason he wrote it is to give the surgery resident on call, when you're like sitting there at night, like you can read this easily, and it's actually fun to read. It's not a text at all. So it's really fun to read. It talks about uh, a lot of different injuries, and it'll give you insight into uh, the kind of shit that the trauma surgeon kind of comes across, which is sometimes a little crazy. It's really, really good for everybody, I think. I think probably if you haven't had any anatomy, it may be a little bit difficult to follow, but other than that, you don't need to be like a surgical resident or anything. Um, I think for a medical student or a college student going into medicine, it would be, it's really good. So for example, here's the chapters. Uh, the 3D trauma surgeon, he talks about having just awareness all the time. Uh, stop the bleeding, how uh, multiple ways we can stop bleeding or options. Um, a crash laparotomy, which is laparotomy was like when somebody's bleeding their belly, you open their belly really fast and like try and stop the bleeding. And, and then the steps of like what you do. So it's kind of cool. Hollow organ injuries, the injured liver, colon ninja master, right? And then um, the take outable solid organs is chapter seven. So it's just a really fun book to read. Um, and I really highly recommend it for anybody, especially if you're in residency, in a surgical residency, general surgery residency, you have to read this book. Anyway. All right, hey, I'm gonna do some more reviews and stuff. Just only things that I really, really like. I'm not gonna spam you with a bunch of crap because I hate when people do that. And uh, these, this book right here is one of my, on my top, top of my list. All right, hey, you guys, thanks for watching. Uh, I'll talk to you later. And subscribe, like, comment, share if you would. That'd be sweet, and I'll see you the next one.